in this video I will show you how to build your own voltage telemetry sensor for FR Sky. The voltage of your aircraft battery can give you some very important information during flight. First of all, it's an important indicator of the remaining flight time. It also shows you if the battery is capable to provide enough energy for your flight system. You can buy a ready-made voltage sensor on Hobby King. But it's also very easy to build one yourself. You only need some few components to connect your battery with your receiver. All you need is one resistor with 20 kilo ohms and a 5 kilo ohm potentiometer. Very important, use the potentiometer on the negative side. The ratio should be 1 to 4 between the potentiometer and the resistor and 5 kilo ohm at minimum. You can solder them directly together or on a circuit board. The potentiometer is very useful for the sensor calibration, but not necessary. It's a good idea to bring the components in place before you solder them on the board. I use an old server lead for the connection between the sensor and the receiver. Some flux can help you to pre-thin the wires before you connect them to the sensor board. In this case I use the yellow wire for the positive and the brown wire for the negative connection. Use a 3-pin servo plug for the receiver. Leave the middle pin empty. The black wire goes into ground and the yellow wire into RX on your receiver. Now it's time for the sensor calibration. Use a power supply with a constant voltage. Turn on your radio and check the voltage value. Adjust the potentiometer on your sensor until you get the right value. Adjust the voltage on your power supply and recheck the value on your transmitter. If you can't reach the right value, you probably have to adjust the voltage ratio. In my case, on the FRSky FLD02 telemetry display, I can simply do this by entering the menu and changing the voltage ratio. Of course, you can build this much lighter and smaller, but for demonstration, I built this a little bit bigger. Thanks for watching and see you next time.